were trying to play themselves off like they were just part of the crowd, whereas this guy has his security vest. Just looks like a little bit much for someone who's asking for ID to get into a restaurant, you know? All right, we are so close to the gas station now. Weather last night was just terrible. It must have been because the friggin' ground is. Yeah, shops are open. Shops are open. The smart ones, anyway. Dollarama's open. The pizza shops are open. I went to Giant Tiger again this morning. Uh, what else? The cell phone place is open. Pizza Hut is open. Uh, is this place? gas station is open after I walk there. I expect it will be. There's the mission up there. There's absolutely nothing going on there at all. Nobody's trying to break down their door to get food or use their shower or anything like that. There's probably not even homeless people at the homeless shelter to be quite honest with you. Why would there be? Why would there be? Have a look downtown. Food everywhere, heat everywhere, tables full of free clothes, party atmosphere. There's probably, I'm sure, there's probably joints going around everywhere. Oh, well, look at this. So, uh, this is a club, right? Right in the center of your screen. Cafe Decuff. Read the word backwards. That's not the real name. Read the blue part backwards. I like that. You're our eyes. Yes. I'm sorry I have to leave all the action right now. But uh, if they weren't down here parking, freezing their ass off, and sitting in a car for days on end, there would be nothing for me to uh, record and nothing for you to watch. So uh, just in case nobody else does it, we're going to do it. I'm sure they will do it for him, but can they get to him in time? There's a whole lot going on, right? And I completely understand why he wants to stay there instead of doing it himself. I've been in many situations like that. So, it's going to take us, I don't know, 20 minutes or something like that. But uh, we're doing it. Uh, this place is open. They're saying that everything's closed. It's funny because the only thing that's closed is Rito Center. Everything's closed, by the way. Yeah, I don't think so. No, no. Everything's open, actually, and more than happy to take your money. And they would like to let you use their bathroom, but they've been told not to. Look at this. This place is just packed. Look. I didn't know you could park here. Huh. Together we stand. Okay, here's what I was trying to tell you. This is so abnormal for Canada. Or for at least here. I can't speak for everywhere, right? But nobody ever flies flags. I was always so jealous of Americans. It made me sick we didn't fly our flag. Because I live in a border town. And Americans fly our flag with theirs. Americans are very flag-happy people, and uh, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. There's been something wrong with Canada that we weren't so proud of. Our Sorry about that. I didn't know you were there. I thought you Huh? Emperor? Not enough. Ottawa. Ottawa? Yeah. Ottawa is USA? No, Ottawa here. But I'm a trucker, so I never use French. I don't need to. I just sit in the truck by myself, you know? Oh. We're from uh, Lac-Saint-Jean, Quebec. Are you? Yeah. Welcome. Yeah. We are so happy to have Thank you. Thank you. Liberté. Where's your truck? <laughs> Where's my truck? Yeah. Uh, way up there in Vanier. Like some holiday? 
Ja. Ja? Ja. Ja. We go to the party and the cousin off. Stop cousin off and the... Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> you too. Have you been down there yet? It's awesome. Liberté! Merci. Okay, so, yeah, there's nothing wrong with uh, being flag happy. Canadians should be, and now we are. So when I was crossing the city this morning, everybody had flags across their antennas or the back of their vehicles or, you know, custom flag sticks like this. Look at this, we're in one parking lot. And you can see what it took. Like, I could honestly go years with that seeing a flag coming off of the car. Now, everywhere has them. It makes me super happy. Super happy. All right. We're going around the corner here. Sorry, I forgot to read chat again. I was really trying to uh, Get my French going good, but it wasn't working so great. <laughs> my French sucks. I know this. I know this. I know. Uh, Gabriel's Pizza is open here. Holy shit! I told you the other day that this movement has gas higher than I've ever seen it. Well, it's now gone up again. $1.54 for a friggin' liter. There's like four liters in a gallon. I think 3.96 liters in a gallon. Yeah, before this movement happened, I think the most expensive gas I ever seen was $1.47. We're getting up to 10 cents more than that almost. Which means that this guy is not gonna get very much in his tiny little can. I think this only holds five liters. Yeah. It's not a lot, but hopefully it will keep them going until we can find someone with a big can. We've got trucks down there. That's the bridge to Quebec. I believe this is uh, Mackenzie King. Is it? Uh, no, King Edward. King Edward Bridge to Quebec and there's trucks down there again. We might have to go down later and have a look. Alright, so someone was asking me if we were using Shell fuel here for the convoy. And I was telling them it's either Shell or Patch Canada. She is a Patch Canada here. Yeah. Whoa, I almost fell on my ass for freedom. Freedom! Yeah! yeah. All right. I'm going to set you down for a minute. Oh, shit. I don't have the tripod attachment on. bother going through my bag to find the tripod attachment for the gimbal. I'm just going to have to deal with it for a sec. I just wiped out of the gas station, so if any of that happens down at the convoy, you can't blame the truckers, because the whole city is like that. Ottawa and the stupid instructions are in French. Not that I have a problem with that, but it should be in both. What if I didn't understand? Oh, we're good. I figured it out. I'm approuvé. Okay. <laughs> 